once again, ladies and gentlemen. American Airlines Flight 10th floor. Hey y'all, happy Monday. I just touched down in Miami a couple of hours ago. It's been a while since I've been in Miami. The last time I came here was with Ryan. We woke up super early in the morning and it was right after our formal, so we were super freaking tired, but I like wanted to go to Miami with him so bad, so we made a whole day out of it and we actually drove back the same day, which looking back on it, it was actually insane of us to do. But this time I'm actually here for work, which is exciting. You guys probably know that I'm a YouTuber, Instagrammer, influencer I guess <laughs> but that's not actually the reason why I'm here I'm not with a brand or anything um, so I actually do videography and photography on the side and honestly if it wasn't for YouTube I would have never found this passion of mine so I'm so thankful for YouTube so I'm here for a videography gig and I'm so excited because they paid for my travel and I actually did um, a gig with them while I was in college so I went to UCF in Orlando and um, they hired me for a gig in Tampa two times and so that was really fun and now I am living in Texas but they flew me out here to Miami. I'm really excited to be here because I actually get to see so many familiar faces. One of my best friends works actually 15 minutes from my hotel so we're gonna meet up for dinner tonight and I'm so excited to see her. Her name's Megan. If you guys have watched my videos or vlogs when I was in college, which was like not even like six months ago. Tomorrow I'm meeting up with two of my sorority sisters, so it's really nice to have a sorority because you can just connect with like so many people that live all across the country and yeah, it's just nice to not be alone because I was really worried that I was just gonna be stuck in my hotel and like be in this beautiful city and not be able to do anything. So I'm very grateful that I can meet up with them and that they're free. <laughs> so I'm staying in a hotel and I got the prettiest city view and a pool view. And I honestly really wanted to go to the pool, but I have like kind of a lot of work to get done. I have to sign a contract, send contracts out for my photography business. There's so much editing to do. I shot a wedding yesterday, so I'm gonna edit those pictures and just so much to do. Especially with photography and videography, I try to prioritize them because obviously those are the ones that are paying me and my YouTube videos aren't as important because I can really get them up whenever, especially because I'm not really being sponsored at the time by any big brands. So I am prioritizing, you know, people that are paying me. So I'm trying to get all these wedding photos done by tomorrow night because tomorrow night is the videography gig here in Miami. And so when I get that video, I want to edit it and be done with it within like three to four days. I really take pride in the fact that I can deliver my photos and videos in a short amount of time because obviously in the social media space, it's really important if you have an event, like you need the photos like the next day. Otherwise, it's pretty much irrelevant. Like that's kind of dramatic, but it's it's true. I try to get them as fast as I can while still having the best quality and the best edit. So that's why I want to finish those photos tonight so I can like put all my attention on the video. I hope you guys don't mind, but I'm about to geek out over camera stuff really quick. And I wanted to share like what I'll be using um, for this gig tomorrow night. I'm not really sure what lens to use just yet. I think I'm going to feel it out when I get there because... Um, I might use a wider angle lens if there's like a not that much space to like step back and film or I have my 35 which is like beautiful and I would love to use it um, but we'll just see if there's like enough space to step back pretty much to film but this is the setup oh okay it's dark as shit <laughs> okay now y'all can see it so this is the Ronin S and I'm so excited. I got a new stabilizer. The other one was just vibrating and just like not doing not doing the greatest things. So I decided to get this one instead. And then the camera I'm using is the Sony a7 III. This is my new baby. Say hi. I love you. I love you so much. This is the 24mm 1.4 lens and that's the wider angle lens but 
yeah that is currently the setup i have i always love geeking out over camera stuff but i don't know if y'all are super interested in that kind of thing i try to keep it to a minimum but you know i kind of get carried away sometimes when i got into miami i ubered to the hotel and i literally had to wait like an hour or something like that probably more than an hour because um basically since i'm not paying for the hotel um they had to get a credit card or th uh, <laughs> authorization form from the people that were paying for it this hotel is currently getting construction done stuff like that so i can tell they're like a little bit flustered and when i was sitting in the lobby the whole time i was just hearing like jackhammers and i was like oh did i bring my ad bill <laughs> but it's okay because we made it in the hotel and i'm super pumped to be here i really wanted to get outside but i also don't know when megan's gonna get off work she said six or seven So I just got to the Wynwood area because we're gonna eat at Koyo Taco and Megan is about to meet me. I'm so freaking excited. What's up, dude? <laughs> Guys, this is Megan. <laughs> She's my bestie from this college. Is the work version. Yeah, she just got <laughs> off work. Where do you work, Megan? Aroma 360. You should look it up. It's up and coming. Yeah, um, tell us about it. They start. They opened like five years ago. It's like I'm gonna explain it. Like they have like home scenting, so it's basically scents that go through your air vents, so your entire house is like scented. But they also do businesses like what is going on in the background? Like, <laughs> just sure. <laughs> just sure it was men. But yeah, that's so cool. Yeah. Yeah, and she met the food god, aka yeah. Kim Kardashian's best yeah. friend. So, aka she met Kim Kardashian pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. Great. She works in Wynwood, and we're here now, and it's really cool because it has like all the murals everywhere, and it's just a cool place to be. We're waiting for our tacos. Okay, so we got the fish tacos over here, and I think this is the Churrasco steak tacos. And then we have some lote. So yum. And then I also got a drink. I'm like starving. All I've had was like a bagel this morning at the airport. So we were eating across the street and I look over and it's freaking DJ. I always mess this up. DJI. And basically this company is the drones and the stabilizers, so I kind of geeked out really quick, and it's open, so we're gonna go in and check it out. What the heck? It's like so much. I didn't even know they had all these like crazy gadgets. They have so many. This is the one I have. The Ronin S. Oh yeah, baby. Day, I'm at the FIU campus where the event is being held and it honestly gives me such UCF vibes because there's like fountains and palm trees and everything like that. I have my big obnoxious camera bag on me and I'm walking to the Graham Center. I guess that's where the event is being held. Due to copyright reasons, unfortunately, I cannot place the whole event recap in this video, but it's okay because I have a whole Instagram dedicated to my photography and videography. It is called Sonali Productions, and I already posted the video on there, so go give it a watch. Let me know what you guys think. Comment an emoji if you are coming from this video and watching that video. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye!